most honored of you in the sight of Allah and those who fear Allah the most. So we don't care about your ethnicity. We don't care about none of that. The thing that we care about is the obedience to Allah the Almighty. We, as a people, when we followed our teachings, were at the pinnacle and the height of civilization. And we contributed so much to the building of who, who, what the world is today. And yet, when we are silent and not active and engaged and involved, ultimately what tends to happen is all the negativity replaces all the light that we could bring in. We can only destroy ourselves as Americans if we allow fear and hatred to turn us against each other. And through that fear and that hatred, be willing to undermine the principles of liberty and justice that make America great. And it is those who defend those principles of liberty and justice that make America great. It is the American Muslim community that is today at the forefront of defending these principles of justice. We are the ones that inshallah will make America great for all people. That is our role, my brothers and sisters. There's no better prescription, there's no better antidote to solve the social ills that we are seeing and experiencing, whether they be inflicted upon Muslims or whether they be inflicted upon other than Muslims, then to, you know, no other antidote than the Qur'an itself. Rasulullah sallallahu says, اِتَّقُ النَّارَ وَلَوْ بِشِقَّةً Keep yourself away from the hellfire even by giving a small piece of date. We are the Ummah, Ummah Muhammad, who is meant to stand for justice, who is meant to stand against oppression. We are the Ummah that is meant to stand up and say, we are there for you. Join us with your family and friends to spend a memorable vacation weekend full of learning and fun. For the 23rd Annual ICNA Mass Southeast Convention in Atlanta, from December the 23rd to the 25th. Become part of the largest Muslim family event in the region and gain inspiration and knowledge from world-renowned speakers, sisters programs, a parallel youth conference, delicious halal food, a captivating bazaar, and much more. You get to see a lot of different cultures. You get to you get to learn really, really much, and you open up more and more. Every time you visit ICNA, you, get, you open up more and more about Islam, you know? ICNA Atlanta benefits me and my kids and my family because it brings together a lot of people from uh, all over the United States. The moment we came here, it was just, it was just such a beautiful scene, you know? You see Muslims everywhere. You see Muslims helping each other out. You see, you see everybody being eager to to seek knowledge, and it's just a beautiful thing to see. Ikna has benefited me because I learned more about my religion, and uh, I guess it built up my faith in a way that any obstacles I face in life, I know how to overcome them. Ikna Atlanta Convention, one of the great opportunity and fortunateness for us to be present here as one ummah to be exposed to numerous scholars. We don't have a big community in Greenville, South Carolina, and knowing that there's a lot of Muslims here and you get to meet a bunch of YM chapters, it's great to have that because it's holiday time. There's nothing open anyway for Muslims, and it's a good environment. Uh, the Ikna Atlanta Convention has benefited me mostly because as an American Muslim, I find that a lot of the topics that are being discussed by speakers are relevant to today's times. They're a great reminder to the things that we need to pay attention to as American Muslims, and for me, especially as a mother of children in this country, um, a lot of the things that are being discussed having to do with identity, growing up in this country with all the influences that are around are very relevant to me. Throughout the three days, I think the ICNA convention really helped me, uh, really gave me a lot of opportunities to meet new people and make new friends and learn more about Islam and it showed other like non-Muslims that we aren't these stubborn people just sitting at home mad all the time and, and I had a lot of fun.